Hello everyone, welcome to Savvy IT Solutions. My name is Jain Mirikali, I am a CTS4 Finance Consultant. So we will walk through the gross margin report in profitability analysis. Here let me give a little introduction to COPA and gross margin analysis report. Profitability analysis enables you to evaluate market segments which can be classified according to products, customers, orders or any combination of these or strategic business units such as sales organizations or business areas with respect to your company's profit or contribution margin. So the aim of the system is to provide your sales, marketing, product management and corporate planning departments with information to support internal accounting and finally the decision making. With the market segments theory app, you can report an actual cost for a market segment for a selected period and this app shows comprehensive gross margin report requirements. So let us go and execute market segments actual sphere app. So provide fiscal year. Self GL account hierarchy. So select margin report hierarchy. Click OK and then select GL account group just press F4 and you can see the till down and you can see PNL before tax and after taxes and just till down further to see the report so it gives comprehensive till down so you can select Under net sales, you can see revenue and discounts and material costs, and then you can see labor costs and manufacturing costs and different type of variances. So here you can also find the production variances there and other different type of variances. And then you can see admin overheads, marketing overheads, and non operating income and non operating expenses there, and taxes. Just select one of the comprehensive node that is CM3 and click on OK. Right? And then click on Go to see the report. So now report is ready. On the right hand side you can see multiple dimensions. So you can select any one of the dimension to review the report. So now I selected product. So I can see the report by product now. So I have customer group and I have material group and I have GL account. And I have to report by product. So you can see multiple products there and the amount in controlling area currency and quantities updated there. And you can extend the report by selecting different type of dimensions. So just click on graphical display. So that's a graphical display mode. So you can view by quantity and uh, amount in controlling currency. So let us make it bigger. So you can review the graphical display report here. Go back to data analysis. So 
So let us add one more dimension to the QR code. So I have added unit of measurement. So let us review the unit of measurement. So we have different unit of measurements like these and uh, different type of other unit of measurements. So whatever. So just click on go back and thank you for watching the session.